why do we have to wait until there's another high profile shooting or murder to get something done? I've said it before and I'll say it again. CPD will continue to go after these people to make our streets safer, but we absolutely need everyone to step up to the plate and take a stand and say enough is enough. Now I'd like to turn it over to Chief Tony Ricky and give you more details about the mission. So I know the superintendent said that there were a total of 81 arrests. The, uh, there's actually 120 targets, so there's still 40 individuals who were involved in these operations uh, that we're looking for right now, and uh, efforts right now are underway to locate and arrest those 40 individuals. This is actually the second operation in a series of targeted investigations that are aimed at disrupting the violence on the south and the west sides. I want to stress the common denominator with all the individuals that are arrested and all the individuals that are targeted is violence. That's the common denominator with all. That's what puts them on our radar. When there's guns involved, when there's shootings involved, when there's murders involved, that's where we go to work. That's where we start targeting uh, individuals. Uh, and then just one more comment. One of the guns that we took off the street last night on the west side is actually a machine gun capable of firing uh, 40 to 50 rounds in just a matter of, of seconds. So. Um, the fact that we took that, that gun off the street alone is, is going to be a, a big impact to crime in, in the west side. 